Oh, it's so awesome. All right, right click. <gasps> what? What did that do? Oh my goodness, it shoots out like laser bombs. What's up guys, it's King Daddy DMac, and welcome, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. That's right, guys, thank you so very much for coming and joining me on the adventures as you always do. Please remember, show that amazing support, slam that thumbs up button. That's right, and if you're new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe for the daily Ark awesomeness man and speaking of awesome last episode we tamed up two super amazing awesome bionic tech rock golems and a bone prone bronto does not get much cooler than this well i hope it gets cooler than this but man these things are pretty gosh darn cool we even upgraded one of them to a speed type that's right you can upgrade all the different golems or any of the prometheus dudes really to all different types of power magic um guard lightning fire all different super duper cool types and this one being the speed type it's able to attack super duper fast and rapid repetition very cool and also gets a super duper speed boost with the level up so very very cool i can't wait to get more guys like this and try out the different types but anyway i'm kind of all rock golemed out i want to go see what other amazing dudes we can get today in the episode come here buddy bro come here let's go ahead grab our poison wyvern and let's carry on at the very end of last episode we went and we knocked out a warrior otter craziness craziness and it ends up it wasn't a knockout tame so i've been waiting for this sucker to wake up it hopefully it's woke up by now it's been a long time it's been a full day if it hasn't woke up by now then forget this guy but let's go see if we can uh easily tame this dude check him out and then i'd like to go for one of the boss type prone dudes today either the dragon the dodo rex the brood mother the megapithecus I think they have an Indom too. They have so many awesome boss type dudes. So we'll just see what type of shenanigans we run across today. It's always a good day here in the Ragnarok map. Oh yeah, baby. All right, guys, I'm right in the area where we knocked out the otter last episode and I'm not seeing it. That's could be good news. It could mean it woke up or it could have despawned or died or something no dude 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 right here check this out check this out otter warrior yes otter warrior awesome level two 135 all right let's go see what it says when we get up close to it what what do i do to tame you it says come on don't say fish don't say oh man it says drag a fish to feed oh my goodness bro that is horrible there's no fish right here why would you even spawn here? What are you thinking, bro? Oh, man. How are we going to do this? Um, We might be able to pick him up. I don't think Starscream has a pickup. Unfortunately, I, I'm pretty sure he doesn't. Let's go see. I think the Drake might. But I don't know if the Drake's going to be able to pick him up. All right. Let's see. It would be C. Oh, yeah. They're, they're definite pickup. Definite. All right. Can you chill right there, bro? Chill right there. Let's see if we can scoop him. Oh, dude, we can scoop him. Oh, my goodness. He's flipping out. He is a flipping out. Oh, my goodness. All right. We got to find a fish. Um, Those look like fish, but they're not. They're all beavers. What the crap, man? What the crap? We don't want a beaver. We want a fish. Do we have fish down? Okay, there's got to be fish here. Seriously, there, there's just got to be. All right, let me drop you off, bro. All right, you good? Y'all good? All right, he's all good. Let's go ahead, pick up Venom. Pick up. Let's find ourselves a fishy. Fishy. Oh, yeah. There we go. There we go. Kabammy, I said. Kabammy. Bammy. All right, one fish dead. We'll kill two fish. Why not? Oh, man, we harvested that one. Okay. We got... Crap, it harvested it. Um... Yeah. Fish. All right, we got our fish. Can I pick you up? Go slow. It's so hard to pick it up sometimes. All right, we got our fish. Please only take one fish to tame. Please only take one fish to tame. All right. Do you, oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. There he is. All right, we got to get close. Get close and... 
feed fish. Oh, man, it didn't feed them. Oh, crap nuggets. Do we still have our Okay, we're still holding on to the fish. He went in here. I saw you go in here, bro. Are you kidding me? Where'd he go? What? All right, this is... Oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. Oh, come here. Come here. He's so quick. He is so gosh darn quick. Come on. Feed fish to tame. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, no. Okay, we sold the fish. We sold the fish. Here. Yeah. Here. Yeah. Drag fish to feed. I got a fish in my hands. Do not see the fish in my hand. Oh, what a dummy. What a dummy. All right. I don't know if having this Drake on my shoulder is messing things up. Let's take him off. Let's get another fish. Man, this otter, though. Such a little piggy when it comes to the fish. All right. Got you. Yeah. Come on. Go slow. Go slow. Drag body. Drag body. Okay, we got him. All right. Where the crap did it go this time? What a pain in the butt. I've to Oh, thank goodness. Come on, bro. Come here. Oh, yes, we got him. Oh, prime order. Otter warrior. So amazing. Let's put him on passive. Unfollow. And can I pick you up, bro? Dude, look at that. Oh, my goodness. You think you're a little tiny otter. You are a ginormous otter. You're way too big to be able to go on my shoulders. But hey, he don't know that. He don't know that, and what he don't know is allowed to happen. All right, come on, Venom. Let's go. Let's head back to the base, and this guy should have to take a saddle. So let's hope that it's cool and not just a gaggy thing, which it very likely is. But either way, pro, uh, Prome Otter Warrior. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. All right, let's go, Starscream. Let's go. I'll meet you guys back at the base. All right, guys, back at the base, and holy crap, look at the sizes of this otter. It is ginormous. It stands so much taller than us. This actually might be a decent mount. I just don't know. Let's go ahead, put on the saddle. I got it pumped up, Celestial, so that's Ascendant, 1300 armor, craziness. This guy is 52,000 health to boot, almost 7,000 stamina, over 2,000 weight, and wow, we got a really good melee, too. Bro, you might be amazing you might be amazing let's go ahead and ride wow look at you is it gonna have that little the little thing oh man every single mod has this where it does this every single type that i've gone on and i still don't know what the crap that does all right does it have a jump no jump that's the normal walk that's the sprint so definitely is a sprint look at how happy he is he's like i'm so happy oh and he's got the little otter bite all right cool so I'm assuming what makes this guy stand out as an otter warrior over other types of otters is I assume the fact that you can ride it. I bet you the normal one is just a little tiny guy. So this this would make the most sense to me. Now also notice putting the saddle on, it doesn't make the prone food. So question, does it eat the prone food? All right, we're going to have to find out. Let's go ahead. Let's grab some. Man, you could... Definitely use some speed outside of the water, but it's probably going to be a pretty, pretty decently fast swimmer. And we'll see if it's got the special ability to make to uh, harvest pearls. All right, let's grab some normal meat. Let's grab some pro meat. All right, let's and yeah, that should be good. Oh man, and it, it, I wish it would automatically go to. Oh crap, I messed up my helmet. Hold on, hold on. All right, adjusted. I wish it would go instead of straight to pick up. It should go straight to ride. It would just be more convenient this way, in my opinion. All right, why can it not carry more than that? All right, this things are bizarre. I don't know what's going on. It seems like all otters have like this glitched out. Did that eat, by the way? Just to, okay, no, that didn't eat. It only lets me put on a hundred food. Every almost every modded otter that I've also seen has had issues with stuff. So I I don't know. I don't know what the crap's going on. Let's see if he eats fish. But yeah, they just don't give you the ability to put stuff in their inventory. So oh man, this is weird, dude. It's like not letting me go underwater. Oh, finally, kind of. I gotta aim. The crap is going on it's really weird how it goes underwater all right let's see about killing a fish or something or anything oh my goodness 
What does it hit for? Ooh, 2,000 to boot. That's amazing for a little tiny guy. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Awesome. Oh, I love this dude. All right, starting to get weighed down. I understand. I'll help you out there. There we go. That's more than we'll ever need. Sweet. All right. Come here. More squids. More squids. Give me more. Give me another bite. Beautiful. I'm also noticing it's not getting any black pearls or other shenanigans from them. It's kind of interesting. Definitely kind of interesting. All right. Come on, bro. Let's get back to the surface. Yep. And you can see there. It definitely ate. It ate a fish. All right. So, on that note, let's go ahead. It's not that fast of a swimmer. Definitely could use more speed. Let's go ahead again, dump out most of the shenanigans. All right, we better now, bro? All right, better. <laughs> so, that's its max speed there. And is that doing... I still don't know what the crap that thing does. Ooh, but it is fast. All right, let's go into the lake just real quick. Let's find out if it, it gets silica pearls when it eats fish. All right, guys, so we're back at the little lake where we tamed it. Let's just see. There should hopefully be fish in here. Still really weird how it doesn't dive straight down. See a lot of beavers. That's right. There was all beavers in this lake. Oh, man, they must be chewing, chowing down on all the fish. Let's go down to the next level. Does it have fall damage? No, not really. Not that I could see. Holy crud, but it, when I boosted the speed, it does almost make it unmanageable anywhere else in the water it, it, it's really fast all right and okay that was my inventory saw the prom shard go dude where are the fish at seriously oh my goodness are you serious that there are no fish here all right let's go down to the next level of shenanigans i'm here in holy crap what is that oh my goodness run 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 what the crap is that Oh, it looks like a chief dragon. Looks like a chief dragon. Oh my goodness, stay away from that thing. All right, going down more. Oh my goodness, some other type of dragon. Too many dragons here, bro. All right, can we find a dang fish so I can finish testing you, bro? I don't know what that's got to be an Anunnaki dragon. All right, coming through. Are we, where are we now? Are we in the canyons? Are we in a cave? I don't even know where we are. All right, can we just find a fish? Could a fish be a thing, please? Oh my goodness, no fish whatsoever. You see, oh, there's fish, there's fish, come on. And, all right, he got a silica pearl. Excellent, you are officially an otter. Now you're going home and I'm never taking you out again. That did do 23,000 damage. This guy's actually a decent hard hitter. I don't know, it could be cool, but I have plans for cooler things today. Let's go find herself a boss prom, dude, at last. Holy crap, look it, look it, look it, it's a dragon, it's a dragon. Oh man, I think this might actually be what we go for. I was trying to wait for the, the rain to stop, but man, apparently he's aggressive and he attacks you. So, pretty cool. Now, something special about this guy. Something special, level 150, that's the top level. Oh my goodness, there's two dragons. An Anunnaki dragon too? Um, uh, yikes, 285, all right, let's get the Anunnaki dragon taken care of. Oh my goodness, come here, bro. All right, the other one seems like it's not hostile towards us anymore. Come on, bro, come on. Oh my goodness, all right, we're, we're nailing them. We're nailing them. You got to get out of here, bro. I can't deal with two dragons simultaneously. That is is a little too much for me. Even me. All right. Almost done. Thank goodness for this awesome attack. Oh, crap. I didn't want to hit the dragon. Oh, I hit our dragon. Crap. All right. Anunnaki dragon versus Prometheus dragon. Who's going to win? Or are they just going to spin around in circles until they get to the top? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. All right. The Anunnaki one, quite obviously, is faster. Yikes. These guys are ridiculous. All right. Try and hit him before. All right. Good. We got him. He's handled. He's handled. Oh, my goodness. 
Oh, that was a little stressful. Just, just a little bit. All right, so what's this guy's deal? We did do a decent amount of damage to him, but not much, and it does have Torpor, so it's probably not a passive tame. Now, I've been curious. You'll notice in my little three spot, I have now a compound bow. I made 51 of the Prome Metal Trank Arrows, which should be the top level Trank Arrows for anything from Prometheus. So, that's cool. The next question is, if we were to do this mod without Anunnaki, you'd have to probably knock it out with this type of arrow. So I'm curious, I'm very curious, how much Torpor does this type of arrow do? Is it good? Is it like amazing? Oh my goodness, that did a lot of damage to him. All right, can we, that was after one arrow shot. Oh, that does a decent amount of Torpor. That really does. And with this Griffin, the, the, the um the double team is awesome because i can shoot my arrows off of them now is it instant torpor oh we might have hit our cell no we didn't hit ourselves what the crap did we hit with the second arrow come here bro e oh man come on get get in my line of sight please don't make me waste the now these arrows are extremely expensive just just to put that out there oh bam oh man come on how did we hit him for so much with the first arrow? And now other arrows are not hitting for nearly as hard. I wonder if we got a critical hit. Yo! All right, there we go. We got another one. Maybe it was a headshot, because that, that one did seem like headshot. Oh my goodness. No, the 84 is what he's doing to us. We just missed. All right, come on. Come on. Bam! Oh, man. Oh, wait. What's going on? Oh my goodness. Could he actually be knocked out? Why are you frozen? Why are you suspended in the air? Um, does it freeze them too? Oh, it might actually like stun them. Oh, that's so cool. And you can see all the uh, torporness like hanging off of them. That is crazy town. All right, well anyway, anyway, I'm getting a little taken back by these this whole arrow shenanigans come on come on yo oh we got another perfect hit and maybe another perfect hit i couldn't tell there we got 37 arrows left it seems like he's only getting hit by headshots is is that a thing bro no we got another hit there all right let's see how we're doing on the tour floor. oh my goodness i'm saying Two, maybe three more, but who knows? Maybe even one more for if, if we're that awesome. Come on, we're taking these hits like nothing. All right, we got another awesome hit in. Now notice he's high in Torbor, but he's still attacking us. Come on, bro. Come in, come in. Oh, we got him. Oh, and he's just insta tamed. What the crap? All right, well I'll take that. It didn't even require us to give him any food. That's redunculous. Seriously, bro, that is redunculous. All right, let's go ahead, whistle passive. I do have food on me. I was expecting to have to hop off and give it to him. Oh, somehow he had food on him already. He must have been eating or something. Okay, and then that food might have tamed him instantly. It could be, it could be a thing. That, that might be what happened. Anyway, we gotta get a saddle for this guy. Let's go ahead, put him on passive. We'll leave him on follow. Let's get back to the base. Oh, man. Dragon. Will it be better? I'm going to assume it's going to hit harder, but will it be better than our griffin? I mean, I love our griffin. Our griffin's amazing, but this is a dragon, gentlemen. A dragon. All right, so I'll see you back at the base. All right, guys. We are back at the base with our dragon. I've got the saddle. I've got it augmented and upgraded through the roof through the roof and when I say through the roof guys when I say through the roof hold on hold on go out there when I say through the roof I mean through the roof if you look at our griffin saddle that could be upgraded to 1300 this is the dragon saddle 19,500 that is a ridiculous ridiculous amount of difference in how good the saddle is so what this is telling me is this thing, no matter what, even if it was worse than the Griffin, 
as long as it hits just as hard or almost just as hard, its armor is going to be unstoppable. And look at this. We can upgrade it if we want to a power dragon. A po Oh my goodness, there's poison dragons? Holy crud, that's so cool. A lightning dragon or a fire dragon. Now, notice there is no speed dragon, so that can't be a thing. Dude, this is incredible. Anyway, let's let's go up. I want to mount my dragon. Oh my goodness. Look at how awesome this is. It it definitely looks like a silver dragon with a tech suit on. That is incredible. It's almost like the Moses tech suit. Look at how it like curves around. Oh, it's so awesome. All right, right click. What? What did that do? Oh my goodness, it shoots out like laser bombs. What in the crap? Hold on, we got to see this again. Oh, it's a very nice size. What? That's different than what when it was flying. Hold on. Oh man, so that's almost shooting out of its back, it looks like. Okay, is there a C? Ooh, can we do both the right click and C at the same time? No, it's the same move. There's no X while in the air. No, uh, yeah, that's the right click. Is there an R? No R. Um, what else could be a button? Uh, O. Okay, Q. R. Yeah, nothing else. Nothing else. But it's still, I mean, just that. That is, in itself is awesome. Um, you can see the stamina is kind of going through quick. It is uber slow. And when I say uber slow, I mean uber slow. So we definitely have to work on speed. But man, look at even those those claws, the the front hands. They're all armored up. This guy is so cool. And then the spine. Oh, man. I love him. And he's got kind of a unique sound. It's like a robotic sound of like metal scraping against each other almost. All right. It's cool. All right. Let's see what he hits for. 5,000. That actually is amazing. It's not like so crazy far above what other guys were hitting for. I think like three or 4,000 was the highest we had previously but i mean this already tells me it's gonna be our strongest hitter all right so that's the bite can we find another dino please that we can hit all right there's pteranodon over here let's try the right click come here bro come here oh my goodness all right that blast three thousand let's try the c is that the same thing oh my goodness you really gotta be almost aim ahead three thousand again there okay Oh my goodness, 5,000 with that bite. That is crazy town. All right, how does it run? Wow. All right, so first and foremost, I think speed's gonna have to be a thing. Let's also just, does he, he has his food. So that's gonna pretty obviously gonna be his food, I'm gonna say. So let's go ahead and dump out this meat and it looks like it will definitely harvest meat. Um, let's bump up the speed. Oh man, it only gets a single, a single thing in speed. Oh man, all right. We're probably gonna go to 150, but let's try it at 120. Yeah, that's still pretty slow. Flying, still pretty slow. All right, let's get some more bites going on. And of course, we're gonna get it to max attack. That is, that is a for sure thing, but if we can take care of the speed first, it's gonna immensely help in how quickly we can level this guy. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go up to 150. We might have to go to 200 with this guy. Oh man. Oh, and listen to, th listen to that sound though. It's kind of annoying, but it it's definitely cool. It's kind of is how you'd expect it to sound. I do suppose. All right, on the ground, the C does nothing when you're grounded. But the right click does that and there is no X, no Q, no other moves on the ground. Okay, okay, just I was just double checking, double checking. All right, let me get the levels up. I'll see you back once we're at 150% movement speed. All right, guys, that really did not take very long at all. Already up to 150 and I can tell you, I'm gonna want 200, I think, but at the same time, this guy has got to be a boss killer for us. It's got to be our boss killer. So we may not be able to sacrifice that much for speed. We may have to put it into health. 
it's all gonna depend um but with this is this is basically what we got to use to kill the all the different boss dudes and i don't know which boss dude to go after first because there's so many of them in the pro mod there's so many of them and they all have very different stats all of them though i think the minimum one i've seen had like a million to two million health so not un undoable but it's it's just a lot and i have no clue how hard it's gonna hit the saddle will definitely be super duper helpful for us oh man that's crazy town the saddle will definitely be a super big help but i mean let's just look at this this is i think this is the top top tippity top boss come on can you show me your stats bro i mean look at that six million two hundred that's craziness that is craziness so yeah what is that dark watchman night watchman something like that cannot mess with them it looks it doesn't look that scary but trust me i'm pretty sure it is all right so carrying on let's go ahead and let's level up let's see if we can find some bigger prone dudes to take on and murder oh my goodness the power of this guy we haven't even put a single level into his attack yet not a single one all right guys doing amazing leveling this dude up did we even look at what the other stats were over a hundred thousand health to boot over thirteen thousand stamina over three thousand weight i mean it's just nutballs absolutely nutballs if i didn't already go over that in any case as you could see down there we've got ourselves a chief dodo rex i'm really curious if we can take this guy on we're not anywhere close to max level but i just want to see oh man how how much damage we can do to this guy Ooh, he's doing a good amount to us he has a inflamed and he has that gnashed or gnarled or whatever the crap effect holy crud he's actually eating through us pretty quick come on bro we got you we got you i'm doing all the different types of attacks to him and we got a, like i said a long way to go we're nowhere close to max level oh my goodness but we could defeat him that is so amazing oh man our health that flame attack really gets us down all right what do we get from him whoa look at that saddle dude for a dodo rex super sweet again more of this silly prone scarlet thing don't really know what that does and we probably got a bunch more element from him too all right doing well doing well Ooh, check this out we got another dragon we got another dragon and a rock elemental please don't be a super high level because i didn't check 85 all right perfect wasn't that high oh my goodness and it can't even carry all the rock elemental shenanigans we'll take the oil because we like the oil let's dump out everything else get dumped get dumped all right carrying on come here dragon i know i saw you you better give me a ton of levels seriously seriously this is like i think around 200 something nope nope one it couldn't be 200 because 150 is max 135 that was actually a pretty good dragon but ours is better ours is perfect perfect level for the server come here guys get annihilated oh my goodness why is that not hidden why is that not hidden there we go we got hit there does this do better against flying things I don't know i haven't really used that attack that much yet but finally we're getting to the scorched earth area let's find some wow oh yes wyverns wyverns let's do that attack on them come here it's kind of jerky like if i'm flying forward real quick oh my goodness did that say all right i can't even hit him with that goodness all right let's let's find another one all right you, you there you there i said come here let me let me do that attack against you Ba bammy annihilated it's so much fun come here more wyverns i need more wyverns man his weight though gets filled up so super quickly really got to dump stuff out immediately let's just grab the stuff that we want to keep put it in our keep folder all right is that everything we care about yep that looks like everything we care about let's dump all the rest out yikes it's just so heavy can't carry all this but look at that already 53 more levels it's crazy town 
how fast we get levels from these wyverns come here bros come here get annihilated it's so much fun it's 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 fairly manageable this attack it's fairly manageable I just got to get used to the aiming on it. I wonder if the first person... Oh, yeah, that first person is a little bit better. Just a tad. Come on. Nail them. Oh, you're too quick. They need to be, like, following missiles. Come on. All right. Once we get our attack up higher, it'll kill everything in one shot. But for now, we'll just bite your faces off. All right, so 27,000. Is that the max that we're at now? It's going to probably... Ooh. I don't know, it's it's nowhere near our top attacker as of yet. The scorpion still takes that that um win. Oh my goodness, another dragon. What level are you, dragon? There's just dragons everywhere. Another 135. Let's get him. Come here, bro. Let me let me get you. Let me bite your face off. Bam! And and oh! Almost got you, baby. Yes! Annihilated! Beautiful. Did you leave a bag for me? Because I think you were too heavy. I think I was too heavy to pick up anything. Alright, let's go have a peek see. Is there a dragon bag? Oh, man. It might have deleted it when it was in the air. Oh, they need to have a, a version, a thing on this helmet that lets me see bags. That would be awesome. Alright, let's see what we got for levels now. 95 more levels insanity getting so close to that max all right guys we are doing awesome i should have all the levels to get us to max let's let's check it out so we are at 51 2 3 4 and 5 255 levels putting us at max attack so let's find out what we attack for um i'm also gonna pump the crap out of health because i want to try and take on a boss i want to finally do it now just a heads up, I'm only being so brave right now before being max leveled because I ran a backup of the server and if things go south, if they go foul, if we fail, I do not want to lose this dragon yet. Oh no, but I'd like to for entertainment purposes actually see what we're in for when it comes to one of these bosses. So, 3,720,000. Yeah, I, I think we could do it. I think it could be a thing. Let's go ahead. Let's warm up on this nice little bone racks here. Dude, and we're hitting for 70,000. So it's not substantially more than than uh, other dudes we have, but it is a good bit more. Let's get these final little levels in over here, and we are looking at 300,000 health. And that is way higher than anything else, plus the baller saddle. Oh, man, I think we could do this. I think it could be a thing. I, I certainly hope so. There's a boss bar, so we shouldn't have to worry about much. And let's just hope it doesn't hit through the mount. And ba bam, 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 bam. All right, 14,000. So it does. Holy crap. It does resist a good bit. Oh, my goodness. And that attack is nutballs. Oh, my goodness. So it's giving us burn damage, which definitely kind Oh. Burn damage kind of sucks because it is going to wear through us and our saddle really quick. But we're managing. Now, the resist that this guy has oh, is what makes him so hard. And the fact that, look at that, he's, he's practically healing instantly. I don't think we're going to come close, guys. I'm sorry, but I don't I don't think we can really put a good enough dent into him. Oh my goodness. All right, let's get the crap out of here. Oh, so I mean our survivability, it definitely we can survive the shenanigans, but I mean look at this. He hasn't hit us in how long and we're still Oh my goodness. Go away. Oh, there's another one. Okay. I mean, look at this. We're we almost died from that fire damage and he wasn't even like hitting us. So, I mean, that is a nasty, nasty um, damage to have happen to us. So, we're just going to have to deal with that. Now, the question is, and I know every boss is different, but the question is, what type of dragon should we make this? Which upgrade? This is what I want to know from you guys in the comments. Should we make this guy a fire boss? Should we make him a transformation into lightning dragon, poison dragon, or power dragon i'm thinking power dragon this is what i'm thinking but 
I want to know from you guys, what do you want to see? What type of dragon should we make this? Or should we just not upgrade it at all? That could be another thing. We could also just not upgrade it. I have a strong suspicion though, you're definitely going to want to upgrade them, especially if we're going to have to go against a boss. But hey, pretty cool. We're able to see this guy. Bammy! This guy's max attack pre level up type of shenanigans. The next question I have to have is, guys, I don't think we need more stamina, but should I put in any more stamina? Should that be a thing? Anyway, let's get back to the base. Let's name our dinos, all right? All right, guys, we are back at the base. Oh, yes, and it is that time. Time to name the dinos. For those of you that do not know, at the end of every single episode, I go check through the comments of the previous video for the name suggestions to name our new dinos. That is right. So if you want to help out and name any of the creatures or dinos, all you got to do, it's got to be a subscriber, is a requirement, and you got to put your name in the comment suggestions below. It is just that easy. Oh, so easy indeed. Today we have our newest rock golem, the speed one, and the bronto to name. So. Without any further ado, let's see what are their names. But bammy, we have for the Bronto Tombstone. Oh, that's an awesome name. Totally suiting name for a Bone Bronto. I love it. And then for our Speed Rock Golem, we have Quicksilver. Dude, Quicksilver is an awesome name too. Great suggestions, guys. Great suggestions. Now, I'm really, really curious to see next episode what you guys think I should name the Dragon. Chrome Dragon. Oh man, it is going to be so crazy cool. Bionic Tech Dragon. So I want you to tell me not only the name, but what we should upgrade it to. What type of magical boosted dragon should it be? Power, lightning, fire, or poison? I, I'm going to think poison would be out. For now, anyway. Eventually, we'll want a poison one. Because, I mean, hey, that's like a step above a poison, poison drake. That'll be super sweet. But yes, which type should we do? Anyway, guys, I want to thank you so very much for coming and watching the episode. As you always do, please remember, show that amazing support by slamming that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, do not forget to subscribe so you can be first to watch the Daily Arc awesomeness. And until next time, guys, once again, thanks for watching and peace out.